Oh, these are gray flowers. Chaz, I'm gonna cry. Oh. New home. Do we have the snail pie, first of all? Um, it's in my box. Should we take it out? Because we're gonna Not go yet. fight an ass gore. Someone walled off the stairs. This is not a museum. Jazz, I'm actually gonna start crying. Well... I really don't like this. It's okay. The way is blocked by two padlocks. There's a note attached. Howdy. I'm, this should be you, actually. Uh, is this Asgore? This is Asgore. So do, like, deep, kingly... He's King Fluffy Bottoms! He's King Fluffy Bottom and my dad. And Asgore. And Asgore. And my dad. I love him so much. He's such a gentle baby. Howdy. I'm in the garden. Eh, it's close enough. If you have anything you need to get off your chest, please don't hesitate to come. Sure. The keys are in the kitchen and the hallway. Why? Why? Because fuck you, that's why. Fuck anyone who can't read. Yeah. Frag it. Uh, how do we want to split these? Ago. You can be the right one. <laughs> right. A long time ago, a human fell into the ruins. Injured by its fall, the human called out for help. I'm gonna cry again. You take the key and put it on your phone's keychain. Why so would it have a keychain? I forgot to look in the mirror back in the fucking ruins, and I'm kind of mad about that. Because when you look in the mirror the first time, it's just like, it's you. And now now it's going to be like, despite everything, it's still you. And that hurts me. This is King Fluffy Bun's room. Oh, what's the trophy for? It's, it's a nice trouble. day today. <laughs> All the current pages say it's a nice day. The ink is still almost wet. Almost wet. It's a king size bed. Ha! Uh... Macaroni art of a flower. For King Dad. I'm gonna fucking f mm, light myself on fire. It's a, it's a bureau. There's a Santa Claus outfit inside. Why do monsters know about Santa Claus? Well, Papyrus got all his action figures from Santa Claus. So, Asgore. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> There's a closed door. There are robes and button up shirts. And a pink hand knit sweater that says Mr. Dad Guy. What, Asriel Knits? That's. Uh, I think that was Toriel. Mr. Dad Guy? Yeah. Oh my god. Trophy, number one nose nuzzling champs. That's why the other two, Dog Ressa and Dog. Uh, I thought the dogs that were very the, much. The in dog love. lovers? Yeah, they were number two because they lost to these beautiful goat people. That actually physically makes me nauseous. Why? I just. I can't. No. Like, I'm. I'm gonna cry. Oh, presents. I can't do this right now. Come on. You could do it. Where's my phone? <laughs> <laughs> you gonna call mom? Mom! Mom, you're hot! Nobody picked up. Ugh! Oh. I'm gonna fucking throw up. I'm actually really upset. Oh, now it's... Ah, uh, Pappy Roo! Ugh, oh, guys. Pappy Roo! I need... I need this out. And I'm gonna oh, need... Don't forget the uh, snowman piece. Oh yeah, I'm gonna need that too. Actually... Well, I'm not gonna go fight the king right now, because I gotta do something else first, but still. There's a heart-shaped locket inside the box. Will you take it? Yes. Stealing things? No, it's for me. Sure it is. There's a worn dagger inside the box. Will you take Why it? would... Don't take, take the dagger! Why are you taking the dagger? Because I need it. You, who are you gonna stab? Asgore. Why? I have to. Really? Yeah. <laughs> That's fucked up. I know. I'm gonna put I on thought my we were doing a, a, a mercy run. Okay, so the way this game works is you have to do a neutral run, which is what we're about to do. And then after you do the neutral run, you can do the pacifist run. So we have to actually murder Asgore first. You don't murder him. You'll see what happens. Flowey has to murder Asgore first. It's a drawing of a golden flower. What a comfortable bed. If you lay down here, you might not ever get up. That sounds really dark. It's a twin-sized bed. There are a lot of striped shirts in here. Oh. It's a family photograph. Everyone's smiling. Okay. Dusty toys. Oh. Ugh. 
Azriel, the king's son, heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. There's gonna be more of these everywhere. It's a great reading chair. It doesn't seem like anyone uses it. Doesn't Toriel use a rocking chair? No, it's the same chair. Oh. Looks like gardening tools. More photo albums, scrapbooks, books on how to make tea. Hey. The coals are still warm. I'm gonna fucking die. Asgore needs to see three. Oh god. Oh, my. oh, it's a slime. So... No, actually read it, <laughs> Over time, Asriel and the human became like siblings. How do we want to do this? Fucking... The king and queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope. Yeah, that's perfect for you. <laughs> I'll just only read the right one. <laughs> Asgore seriously needs to work on interior decorating. Get, like, a single painter. Well, Toriel's house looks exactly the same. Just yeah, well, Toriel's color. house had color, and it looked way better. Yeah. Look at how out of, like, place this green key is. Everything's just really sad and depressing here, and I want to die. Oh, God. You didn't key and put it in a keychain. It's a trash can. It's full of crumpled up recipes for butterscotch pie. Mm. I hate this. <laughs> the stove top is very clean. Someone must use fire magic. Yeah. It's a note. Howdy! Help yourself to anything you want. That sounds like <laughs> the old turtle's voice. <laughs> <laughs> but it bug me. So what old first turtle? It's old turtle? The turtle from the shop. The one that told us about the Delta Rune. Oh, did I make him southern? I don't know. It sounded exactly like what you just did. That's what matters. How do you remember these things? Because <laughs> I have to edit them, Jazz. I am so sorry. <laughs> the bridge is full of unopened containers of snails. Ew. <laughs> we have flower. It's a golden flower. I'm sure. I'm just gonna throw up. Like my stomach is in knots. I just have heartburn. That's sad. You want to take something yeah. for that? I don't have anything. Then one day, the human became very ill. Gives all of them the same voice. The sick human had only one request. To see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we could do. My god, you are. <laughs> what? I'm at least trying here. <laughs> the next day. The next day. Yeah, okay. The human that, died. <laughs> that was fucking difficult on my part. <laughs> As you racked with grief. Absorbs the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. Like bird. I'm gonna cry. I really hate this. Oh, it's these assholes. With the human soul, Asriel crossed the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset. Back to the village of the humans. Yeah, a bunch of fucking assholes. Get the fuck out of here. No one likes you. No one likes Jerry. No one likes Ice Cap either. Washua! Washua. <laughs> I'm crying! As we all reached the center of the village, there he found a bed of four golden flowers. You kill the human, I kill it. Washua! <laughs> oh my god. Suddenly, screams rang out. The village saw Asriel holding the human's body. They thought that he killed the child. That was as close as a feminine as I could possibly get. It's fine. Oh, it's the dubbies. The humans attacked him with everything they had. He was struck with blow after blow. Azriel had the power to destroy them all. Destroy them all! Destroy them all! Destroy them all! <gasps> but. Azriel did not fight back. Clutching the human. Azriel smiled and walked away. Like a bird. <laughs> Final fragments! Wounded, Azriel stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. I'm actually crying. It's really hard for me to read this right now. These are whimsalots? Uh. 
the ones after Whimsalots, I don't fucking know what they're called. Final Whimsalots. The kingdom oh, fell into despair. The king and the child and the queen. <laughs> the king and the queen had lost two children in one night. The humans had once again taken everything from us. One of the children's was human. Yeah. How did the humans take everything from me if one of them died from disease? Who was also human? Oh, I don't... Just... The king decided it was our time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier forever. Tom, you want to get a lozenge or something? <laughs> <laughs> it's crying and laughing. Yeah. King Asgore will save us all. Oh, King Asgore will give us help. <laughs> He's just like the slow one. <laughs> He's like the Internet Explorer in between Firefox and Chrome. <laughs> you should be smiling too. Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy? My eyes are just really not okay. I can't even read. You're going to be free. Please stop doing this to me. I'm going this way. Oh. oh never mind. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm going this way. Ding. Cause I gotta, I gotta go. Guys, I gotta, I gotta go. I got, I got bathroom break. Cut. Let's go. Okay. Guys, I'm gonna take a bathroom break because I'm crying and I need something to make me slightly more happy right now. You gotta go to nice cream. I can't go get any fucking nice cream because the royal guards fucking bought the last of it. Uh, there was multiple nice cream stands. Yeah, but he, that was the same guy. He moved. Yeah, he can move back. He won't move back. What an ass. He's a dick, and I just want to live my life. Can I, okay, I was going to say, can I not go back through here? Oh my god. <laughs> this is... So we're going to Meditant's house now? I'm going to go hang out at Meditant's house, because I can. Ha ha! And because I'm crying and I really need something to like pick me up right now. <laughs> I don't think you understand. This isn't the right way. <sighs> Light sea foam green. Light sea foam green. Adding more words doesn't make the situation better. Now, P Pappy Roo is British. <laughs> Everyone's very much English, Jazz. <laughs> So much English. Let's change everyone's voices to something English-like. Then we'd run out of voices! Not with that attitude. We're different We've factions. already run out of voices! We have run out of voices. Oh, I care for a ride. I, yeah, I want to go... It's a kitty boat. It is a kitty boat. That's really cute. God, I'm just so upset right now. Some Totoro shit right now. Please. I do not care for Totoro. I wasn't too big on Totoro, to be honest. I was just like, oh no, the little sister ran away for no reason. Oh no, she's okay. There's a big fluffy monster. Okay, oh okay, uh, we're sitting on its belly. We're we're flying now. What is happening? Like, I watch some weird anime, but sometimes you just. I watch. All right. Th Wait. This is the way to Ten, Ten Village. Village. Where the fuck? Where am I? The okay, this is the way I want to go. <laughs> My life just... It's locked, okay? Fucking give me this. Where... If... If you just... Use the mystery key. The red house's door was unlocked. The key disappeared. Don't ask why. It's a ghost key. Yeah. Dear diary, Shywin's sister fell down recently. It's sad. Without her sister to speak for her, she's become more reclusive than ever. So I reached out to her and told her that she, Bluki, and I should all perform together sometime. She seemed to like that idea. Is this Metaton before he became a robot? Yeah, this is Ghost Ton. Dear Diary, I like to buy a new diary for every new entry I make. I love to collect diaries. <laughs> Dearest Diary, our cousin left the farm to become a training dummy. That leaves just Blukey and I. Blukey asked me if I was going to try to become corporeal too. They sounded so resigned. Come on, Blukey. You know I never leave you behind. 
And besides, I'd never find the kind of body I'm looking for anyway. <sighs> My darling diary, I met someone interesting today. Last week, I posted that advertisement for my human fan club. Today was our first meeting. Only one other person came. Honestly, she's a dork. And she's obsessed with those awful cartoons. You like slightly British? Excuse me, they're anime. <laughs> not cartoons. <laughs> you right? You right? But she's kind of funny, too. I want to see her again. Ooh. <laughs> Diary, my dear. My diary collection is going fabulously. I have like five now. I love. Dear diary, she surprised me with something today. Sketches of a body that she wants to create for me. A form beyond my wildest fantasies. In a form like that, I could finally feel like myself. After all, there's no way I could be a star the way I am now. Sorry, Blukey. My dreams can't wait for anyone. Well, obviously, we need to go hack his computer. No, I can't go past the books. Isn't too fat or something, I don't know. I get yeah, Those are some strategically placed books. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's why there's just enough of them to fit across the thing. Like, just... I... I want to die. <laughs>